Well, I'm feeling somewhat grumpy today as I set out on my ride. Because as you can see, it's raining again, or should I say still. And it's getting a bit much now. I've had five rides now in a row. Well, it hasn't just been a bit of rain, it's been torrential rain. So it's making me feel a bit grumpy. And I know a lot of you are going to be going, yeah, but Steve, you're a grumpy old git at the best of times. And you're not wrong. But every day I go out. And by the time you've got the bike out the shed, your feet are all muddy. And there's this constant attention to the chain. I'd love it if you let me know. How do the rest of you cope? Until I'm in a posh area. Look, we have Waitrose deliveries here. How do the rest of you cope with this constant attention to the chain? Because Quite literally, every time I get the bike out the shed, the chain is rusty. And I do dry it off when I get back. And probably every third ride, I degrease it and re-lube it. And it still doesn't help. I just don't know what the solution is, really. Another thing is making me grumpy today is the fact that I can't get the gears to index properly. I don't know if it's just me. So, this is a Fast Road SL2. With a Shimano Sora group set. And I'd be interested to hear from from other SL2 owners if they've had any problems. I took it to Al, he indexed them up. It didn't last more than a few days. And I don't know. When I tried to do it myself, it feels to me like there's 10 clicks on the shifter. And not nine. So I wonder if it's the wrong shifter. And the pull ratio is wrong. Listen to me, sounding like I know what I'm talking about. It's only because I've heard people on the telly talk about pool ratios. 
happy when I was racing there was no such thing. Down tube shifters. Pull it to the gear you want. Push it forward a bit till the noise went away. And if you think I'm longing for the old days, you're very much mistaken. Because it was bloody hard work. And quite often, you stayed in an inappropriate gear for too long because of the effort of changing. So now, of all the technology and improvements, some of which I like, some I don't, of all the technology, indexed gears is the best thing that ever happened to cycling but it is annoying when they don't work and just to say that on my track they work beautifully And the last thing I'm going to moan about today, I hope, is the pedals on this bike. And the problem with the pedals is entirely my own fault for trying to cheap out. I mean, I should moan about the state of the roads. I'm not going to. No, the pedals. You know, Peter Kay, the comedian, talked about his mother buying the cheap alternative to Coke. Roller Cola. Yeah. And these pedals are Roller Shimano. Thank you. Well, just really isn't working today. So back to the pedals. Wow, no flooding going on there. When you try and ride on your toes because you're negotiating a tricky bit and you don't want to be clipped in you just keep clicking straight back in and then when you want to get away a bit quick you start pedalling and you want to get your feet in they won't click in It's really just a quality issue. You can just feel it compared to the Shimano's I've got on the track. You can feel it when you 
move the spring tensioner or anything like that. So these pedals, I would advise you not to cheap out. You see, they're called Boardman. Yes, they're designed to give you the impression that they're handcrafted by a world famous cyclist. But they're not. They're made by Halfords. who bought the Boardman Company some years ago. I'm only using one camera today. And my feeling is this video may not even be usable. And if it is, you're going to see a lot more rain on the lens than you are scenery. But you will see the impatient car drivers desperate to get past. Yeah, I'm quite enjoying being out. My feet are soaked. I do need some overshoes. And that's the thing. No matter how down you're feeling, get out on the bike. Chances are you will enjoy the ride. And it isn't that cold today. That's the big difference in Wales. between winter and summer. The rain is a bit warmer in summer. And here we are at Blackmill.